Alrighty, more Hearts Medicine 3 Hospital Heat. We're at the Intensive Care, level 47. Ruckus, calm the doctors and staff coming into Intensive Care. He literally took away the chairs in the waiting room. These are pregnant women we're talking about! Or pregnant people, but yeah. You think that's bad? Yesterday, like some evil villain, Victor took away half the toys in the children's ward. He also replaced all our sheets with thinner sheets. Because if people aren't comfortable, they'll leave quicker. He also switched to cheaper cleaning supplies. Smell me, I smell like a lemon. I really hate lemons. If this keeps going, there'll be nothing left of this hospital. Someone's going to have to do something. I'm sorry. I fear this has to do with Victor's grudge against me. I'll go talk to him this evening and see if I can get him to lay off. Yeah, I'm sure that's gonna work. Well, uh, you're trying. Good. Alright, let's buy all the chairs, I guess. Oh, it's like one big sofa! Cool. Calm the doctors and staff. Oh. I thought this was too zoomed in, but I just realized it's not. <laughs> I, uh, tricked myself, I see. Okay, that was fast. K fast. Quick fast. K fast. Oh. What? I just had water! What? Stocked 250 items. I believe I missed clicking that.
that I clicked Allison. So why? staff that's good I'm gonna pretend I've gotten Oliver because I really can't remember these levels are quite long at least for me There's still people coming in. No, we're done though. This was uh, Lancelot, apparently. Lancelot Hughes or something like that. Five, five, five. Um, I guess. Come in! John, I was wondering when you'd show up. Do you like what I've done with the place? No need to be mean, Victor. You've won. Oh, but there's totally a need to be mean. I didn't spend the last 15 years clawing my way back to the top for nothing. Okay, Victor, feel free to take your revenge out on me. But these people, they don't deserve that. The patients don't deserve that. And even by your standards, you've been enormously harsh. Harsh? I was harsh off the board. Blah. It was harsh off the board to take my license over a small mistake. It was harsh for my partner to report me to the board in the first place. Harsh? I'll show you harsh. You'll feel exactly like I did as everything I cared for was taken away from me. What, money? You've literally only shown that you care about money and prestige. Harsh. You haven't seen the half of it. I will run this place into the ground. 
but not before I turn a profit on it. Okay. What about all the people who are dying in here? You can't. Oh, I can. And I will. Feel free to leave at any time now, John. Okay. Challenge 24, minigame mayhem! Oh. <laughs> okay. Level 48, blast from the past. Don't still still bleh, don't stand still for longer than 13 seconds. Welcome to our team meeting. I was walking through the basement and just happened upon a treasure trove of old unused equipment. And I thought to myself, these models are actually still pretty good. It'd be a shame not to use them. Uh if we all start using the slightly older machinery, we can sell a lot of our newer devices. But some of those machines haven't been used in over 10 years! Yeah, do they even work? Most of them do, but I have an old country guy that's fixing up the rest. You know those machines aren't up to the current safety codes. We'll have a small group of people evaluate which machines are and aren't up to code over the coming months. But in the meantime, you'll all just have to get used to doing more things by hand. We used to do everything by hand back in the day, and I never heard any complaints back then. Yeah, because there was no other way of doing it! That- that is not a valid argument! I thought you were going to talk to him. I did. <sighs> Okay, he seems more determined to kill people, rather than just running the hospital in the ground. Oh. But, uh, amazing! Huh? Oh, huh. Oh, huh. Oh, there are loads of innocent people who are going to be effect affected by this oh. what oh ah oh ah oh ah oh ah
already forgot. Ah, blah, 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 okay. to keep a tr keep track up here oh oh ah oh ah oh one. Oh well. We're halfway through. Margot Graham. Oh. <laughs> 
Listen, what are you doing? Why do you keep doing that? done if I just don't screw up now with the whole walking thing That, but that's cool. Got the results from the test Ruth ordered. Wait, why are you working with CF 100s? Those are from the 1980s. That's not important right now. Let's go see what Ruth thinks. We've got the results. Well, hand them over, dear. Here! It's very hard to see, but there are some small deviations in hormone levels. It seems the liver isn't breaking them down completely. The slower liver function keeps adding more and more hormones to the bloodstream, which may be causing some of your mother's symptoms. The rest could be caused by a relatively simple blood deficiency, made worse by the hormones. It makes sense that Quinn didn't find this. It's almost impossible to spot. Luckily, a slow liver is very treatable if we treat it in time. We just have to give it a boost with Livax. And we've got Livax right here! <laughs> then what are we waiting for? And then Victor comes and is like, uh, no, it is too expensive for us to actually treat patients. Where do you think you are? Whee. 
Uh, but yeah, that's it for this episode. So next time is the last episode for the intensive care. So yeah. Thank you for watching and uh, see ya.